The next speaker is Aroa Algaba Granero, with the title Cervantes on Stage, History of Theatrical Production and Adaptation. Idle here, I am sure you have held a Cervantes book at least once, but have you ever thought how is he revived on today's stages? Have you ever wondered in what production uh, and how he is taken to, this, to the stage? Although in, the, although in the past, in the golden age, his uh, plays weren't successful, from the 20th to the 21st century, many different adaptations have been performed um, based on various genres of servant in production. The analysis of this production's reception in Spain and abroad from 1916 from 1916 to 2016 will enable us to evaluate the current impact of Cervantes' intention, the greatest author of Spanish literature, through the most striking stages. The influence of historical moments, each one with different ideologies, um, institutions, events, tendencies, and theatrical techniques will be considered in the creation of Cervantine spectacles. Among them, you can find from uh, an adaptation of Numancia, exalting Francoism, to uh, a version of The Journey to Parnassus, a long poem with pupils. In order to achieve this, bibliographical sources, newspaper articles, um, interviews, and notes from current productions will be used. Following the analysis and classification of this material, Cervantes' survival nowadays, as well as um, his dramatic possibilities and universality can be proved, the moment or culture where his plays are performed regardless. This way, present and future stage productions will be encouraged. And Moreover, philological studies will be connected to drama ones. And also, uh, moreover, you can show how this, um, this production works on stage. As a result, Cervantes, uh, as a result, Cervantes uh, stands up from that abandoned book at the bookshelf and Mm, makes us spectators of timeless conflicts on stage and places a mirror in front of us. There is no better way to pay homage to the author who is present in Don Quixote's words. As a child, I was fond of the play, and in my youth, a keen lover of the actor's art. Thank you very much.